Hello everyone and welcome to the Roulette Rounds presented by Canadian Disc Golf Productions. I am Chris Brown and I am joined here again by... James Duong. That's right. Not Wallace Kent as you see on the thing, he's taking a break again for this one. That's why he's called the Nap God. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Today we are at King's Forest in Hamilton. It's a winter only course. Um, it's quite long, quite open, and relatively treat. To start us off, we have Alejandro Diaz. He's got a bright future in this one. It's indeed, I think he's, I want to say he's just turned 15. Then we have Adam Beatty. B stands for bomb. For bomb, yes, he throws bombs. Mm -hmm. That counts. Jake hey. Boss Camp. I don't think he needs much of an introduction, but Guy's this is him. A name for himself. Mm -hmm. He's a great disc golfer. Great human being. And then we have Kalen Shat. Big smile, great personality. Great player. Mm -hmm. So this card today is going to be mostly our young young players. I think they're all under twenty. Mm. I'm not but they're going to be throwing, maybe maybe like... maybe twenty one maybe twenty one, but they're around that age. But they all throw. They are solid. Very far. Hole one, 551 feet. It's it's on the edge of gettable, but I would say it's pretty much ungettable. It's just that a little bit extra far. That oh, yeah. makes it hard to get to. Playing from the white tees? Yeah, the whole day we'll be playing from the white tees, which are the middle tees of King's Forest. Looks like a great day so far. Yeah, it's much better than the last video we had when we had a foot of snow up in Aurelia. But oh, that's a great pull. It's a great pull. Anybody beady. can watch Pull flight. All the way down there. That's about, I shot that's oh, about yeah. as good as you're gonna do, really, trying to get all the way to the basket. Mm -hmm. No. Jake, now sponsored by Gander. Awesome. Well, I had the pleasure of playing with this guy, and uh, we went down to Florida. Oh yeah. He could bomb. Yes, he can, as he you see from this. Beautiful throw. Did you get all the way up to that fallen wow. tree? I'm that, not, that, I'm not nice that tree would have fallen within the last month nope. or so. Still waiting to be cleaned up, but it adds a nice little feature to the the, 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 the green of the hole. Mm -hmm. Stay in the oh, air. it's fighting out. I thought he threw that with Love too much it. Anheuser, but it looks like that's what he was intending. Just Great low, job. hard, driven Anheuser. Man, they all got way up there. I'm playing here. Alejandro, the farthest one back, and this is like a quite a reasonable drive. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay. Oh, nice. Gets around it. Oh, good shot. Oh, he's he's basket high there now. It's a great shot from Alejandro. We'll have the putt. Oh, great. Oh, the little short actually. Yes, indeed. So let's go over the rules again of the roulette rounds. Everyone starts with six of their discs of their choice. As you play the hole, if you win the hole, you get to take from whoever lost the hole. So if you win, if if three of you birdie it and one of you pars it, three of you get to take from one disc each from oh, no. that last player. So you could get out of get out of control pretty quickly. One bad hole and you can lose half your game. Yeah. So it looks like how did Adam get into this tree? Do a back end and just was short. Oh yeah? yeah. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, that was right. for his three. So as he's taking the four, I think Alejandro as well. This is for Kalen's three because he's up on the hill now. Oh no. Oh. Putting, all putting all up to Jake right coming. here. He's the last one to get a chance for a three. So if Jake makes it, he gets his choice of disc from one of the other the other three competitors. He doesn't get a disc from each, he only gets one. So what, 25 feet uphill? It's all well within Jake's putting range. Oh yeah. Oh, oh but it is a little tricky. Cold. Yeah, in the cold weather, first hole on camera, everything, everything's harder that way. He threw so far that he just I just think <laughs> on a par <laughs> four. <laughs> it says par three at the top. But oh, really? I think, I, th I think for most club and uh, the pars are very generous. Mm. So I think par three is appropriate. The top part. I don't think I've ever had a chance to get a two on this game. It's a, wait, it's a big yeah, pull. Yeah, it, it's a big pull, but 
if you take a four, you're dealing seven. Yes. As I'm pretty sure everyone on this card is taking fours. No. No smiling. Yeah. Not a. Uh, yeah. Exactly. Nobody. Nobody's truly ecstatic about their four, but nobody loses the disc. So. Yeah, in the background. Alejandro's mother. Very. Uh, she was over to the right. Very well known in the GTA disc golf community now. At least the West End. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Nicest people you meet. Hole two, if you haven't played here, is 214 feet over the bunker, which plays as hazard, uh, onto this mound. And then if you go past the mound to the path, it is OB as well. So you really got to check up on your, uh, yeah. your distance. I do like throwing a spike hyzer on this just to get, get the mound and stop. Did you for some reason? I did. I did. I know. 2023? Yeah, I've got... Uh, um, was it this year? Or it was year? this year, yeah. Look at that, right. nice. I almost forgot. I almost forgot what year it happened in. I think I have more aces this year than I do it last year. Ha. <laughs> okay, that, that could be long. No, oh, that's right. actually fantastic. Nice. Didn't get a skip, didn't get a roll. Probably got a 30 footer up the hill. Scary pot, though, coming out the bunker, though. Mm -hmm. You have to think about where they're going to lay that up or going to give it a good run. I feel like this is in his Toro. That would make sense. That would make sense. That's the right stability of this, for this type of hole on the spike kaiser. You just want something that's going to hit and stop. Mm -hmm. What do think Kalen's reaching for here? Uh, zone? That's very strange. I, mean, I think that could be a zone. So. Maybe a Luna? Oh, Possibly. Yeah, it's, he's putting with the same disc that he threw, so I'm assuming it's Luna. Oh, oh no! That's Rolls yeah. it into the bunker. Oh. Oh. Hazard bunker, so he'll be taking a best of four, right? Yeah. Alejandro smartly lays out, no point. No point in losing a disc? No point in putting yourself in a position to get a four and lose a disc. You don't need to take them, you just gotta hold on to them. The winner of these matches, who has the most discs? Wh whoever has the most discs mm. at the All end. Right. Take them another chance. And then the final, whoever whoever comes top two in this, will move on there to the goes. next oh. I'm call it round yeah. of uh, roulette round, where you'll be playing against two other winners from another card. Yeah. Have a good time. Keep uh, keep following throughout the the off season to get some more winter disc golf coverage. Did he fall back into the no, bunker? No, no, I think, uh, I think he's okay. Either way, he's taking more than uh, more than everybody else, so he just takes it up and walks off. Good for pace of play, smart man. Mm -hmm. Are the new holes going to be? Yep. The yes, they are. Right. Oh. What is he taking? Oh, Athena? Yeah. Might be the Athena. Yeah, I think, he, I think he just took an Athena from him. Good choice on a long course like this. Short hole here, uh, newly added this year. It gets very muddy if you're in the fall or spring conditions down there. And probably as it is now as you see the skids. Quite a little fun hole. Just a little putter straight at it if you can do it. I think Jake might be going like a roach. That's a good choice. Yeah, and it flew like a roach. You'll have a 25 footer at the basket. Mm -hmm. Alejandro here. What's he got for us? This is a uh, V5. Is that what they're called? Five? I call I pronounce it five. Five? Okay. Great I think that's a shot. Great oh, that's a yeah. Okay. It flew like a five. Mm -hmm. Oh, it could also be his practice. So it's a lot of five. Yeah? Not a game. Practice. <laughs> no? Yeah, I think I know where you're going with this. <laughs> Talking about practice? I don't know. Practice? <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, flip. Oh. Um, oh. Anyways, yeah, Alejandro throwing a lot of thought space. Is that mostly his go-to? For thought space? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he, being at Bronte and, yes. and near Oz a lot. Drop. Oh! Oh! oh. oh, my. oh. I can't even tell if you missed that, that short or long. That's how close that was. You get a plastic playback. That's the, it's, is it not going in? Did he change the video? 
That may have been the closest ace run I've seen on this hole. And he's still part two. That's the, that's the, the, putting, but like, really the icing on the cake. And now? Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, go in. Alright, okay. not bad. Maybe he had a chance if he got away from that tree, but either, either way, he's up and down. He'll probably get his three and maybe not lose a disc. Oh, no, wait. I can't lose park, isn't he? Pancakes. Pancakes. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> maybe thinking about what you're yeah. going on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cherry cheesecake? True. Cola? Cherry cola? <laughs> Okay. Oh! oh. Yeah. Alejandro okay. with a almost a great pot, just leaves it a little low. I feel like 50% of the time, those would bounce right in. Yeah. yeah. A little bit more pace would have gone in, a little bit higher. There's a lot, a lot of conditions that could have happened. But. Oh, we got two genders on the screen. We do. It's hard to tell them apart sometimes when they're standing back to back. Obviously, Jake's a little bit taller, but. So the two two. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Kalen, Kalen with the almost ace right, gets the right. two, gets his choice, I believe, because there was was there two twos or one two? I think there was one two. And he's taking from Jake. Oof. These yeah. gooses do not fight. Geese, 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 geese. 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 So is that a four club buzz? That was a four club buzz. That's what probably his go to. You know, if he just like walked away right now, he'd be much richer. Mm. Yep, you're not wrong. I don't think he would let him walk away. What's he gonna do? Hit this for the round. Just throwing it over one. <laughs> yeah, I'd say there is some water at King's Forest. It is a possibility. Kalen. Is oh, that the four? Okay. That was the buzz. He just pulled out the buzz. Yeah. Pulled out Jake's buzz right in his face and threw it into the trees. That's a little fucking shame to get that thrown out. Uh, that's a good hole. I have yet to remember the hole, but it's a nice height to flip up. Yeah, it looks so nice on the camera, but it's just, it's such a particular line that you have to get. Right like, about there, if that, if that was a little bit higher, that would have been perfect. Yeah. Because yeah, coming, right. coming in that fast, uh, you need to get above the log to get higher. Oh, that log is probably circled in. Maybe a little inside, like if you're depending on which part of the log you're in, but the closest part is probably around 20, 25 feet. Oh, oh that's good. Cool. Love it. Oh, flip. Yo, Pathfinder is a good one. Oh, Pathfinder? Yeah. Pathfinder is better than Bug, apparently. Really good. There it is, just in front of the log. So, 35 feet probably away. Not really been a showcase of putting in this round so far, so hopefully someone can get it together. Oh, that tree. Oh. That tree. That's a lot of people. I am yeah, not actually. You got your name etched in there somewhere? I'm sure I've hit it enough times you can make up my name in there somewhere. That tree knows you. Yeah. Has your phone number. Calls you every time and everything. <laughs> Adam got his ankles exposed. Oh, was it oh. the same tree? He <laughs> hit the same tree twice. Oh, no. It's the new Adam tree now. Yeah, no, you're, you're off the books now, yeah, buddy. Yeah, I'm taking my name off the tree. Adam is etched. It's Adam's uh, tree now. Mm -hmm. I think he's got a line in there. Those trees are very thick and very small. Cool. He hit a clean That's line was. in there. On one shot. At this point, a Kalen, do you run this? Or do you just lay up, take your three, and guarantee you keep a disc? Oh. I think you're going with the lay up. Mm -hmm. so there's no reason that you could make the two, but why risk trying to get a four, right? I mean, from this distance, though, I think you can give it a bid. You yeah. keep it within, like, your comfortable putting range. That's true. I think oh, I, I think, oh. I, I think at this distance, you have to run it to try and get that extra disc. Right. Here's Adam for his four. For his four. Respectable number if you can get it. Oh, good just job. over. Good, it's good to see he ran it though. He needed the stroke. Come on, Alejandro. For the team. Yes, for indeed. The card. Doesn't look like he's got great posture, great footing. He probably got those trees pushing in on his left side. It's funny how just oh. the smallest oh. touch from the tree can just like <laughs> ruin your. Alejandro off the top for the big, big win to get a, a, the first the first taken disc out. No, no, I'm, I'm lying because K 
Caitlyn should have one of Jake's. Yeah, but they switched on the last hole. Mm. Right? I think uh, the first hole, did Jake take one? Oh, you're Jake? right. Oh, the second hole. Yes, you're right, you're right, you're right. They, 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 they just flip flop back. Mm -hmm. I do appreciate the fact that they didn't, they didn't uh, take their disc back. They went for one of their one of their competitors. Hole five. What can you tell me about hole five? Hole five. Oh wait, actually, let's let's talk about disc exchange first. Oh, they're all taking one from. Oh him. yes, I forgot about this. Everyone Ouch. gets one disc. Oh, that's painful. They're gonna take an order of which they're teeing off. So Alejandro goes last. Are they playing this from down below or are they going up? They're not going up to the very top. They're playing from the uh, traditional tee. Gotcha. Yeah, the one up top is impressive. I mean, full throw. Yeah, you, might, <laughs> you, might, you might throw it to 400 plus feet. I think all these guys have the power to do it for sure. 100%. 699 feet. It is two absolutely full drives mm -hmm. to get anywhere near the basket. Kind of a different uh, scene compared to the last one. Like, mm -hmm. over there, like, foot of snow. Yeah, here. they got premium conditions in this yeah, thing. Oh, that is a little oh, lucky. Over. But I always say it's better. It's always better to be left here than right, so you have a better foot to the basket. Yeah, I mean, so. a hole, you the four, uh, roller that is what I do when it's dry, yeah. I have yet to hit it really nicely, though. Got some decent shots. I really want to see somebody get there with a roller. Whoa. That's, a, that's almost a perfect spot. As long as he's not in those trees, which he's well past those trees, then he'll have a straight wide open approach and the forehand backhand roller. Crazy. Ooh. Oh, Just didn't get in the air. Yeah, that's that short. That's gonna be that's gonna be 500 plus feet to the basket. Maybe maybe not quite, but almost 500 feet to the basket. So. Alright, he's good. Yeah, that's actually that's actually a great spot. That'll probably leave him 360 into the basket, so definitely do with the other side. So you'd rather be more left than have a little bit of a straight spot. Personally, yes. I'd much rather be left than right, because the right you have to over the water through the trees. Mm -hmm. Kaylin's thinking here. He's, going, he's trying to make the gap? He is. Oh, those are great. So good at those forced over any flexes that he ended oh, up short. Oh. Did that hit the rock and roll back? It so like it did, didn't it? It's gonna be tough. His body language wasn't happy with that. Uh, you never know. There's so much room there to land. You never know what you're gonna get yourself into until you get up close. True. Well, he wasn't gonna have the only obstructive puck there. Yeah. Again, Alejandro now throwing three from here. Um, you just need to make sure, unless he throws a phenomenal shot, which she, oh Oops, no, that's a little turned over, but it made it. That's oh, yeah. okay. That's not bad at all. You uh -huh. gotta approach and make it up and down. Yeah, and he's still, he's still <laughs> being approaching for his five, though, so he needs to, everyone here just needs to play safe, try to get their, their four or three. No need to push it. That's that's pretty good. Low, hard, driven at the green, and just hope you play for the skip. Okay. Almost made it onto the green. A little too close to the green for comfort, in my opinion. Greens are still played as OB, right? Oh yes. Fringes are good. Fringe is fine. Only oh, the I shortest like this cut. Angle. There you go. He's parked. He ain't missing that. Ooh, looks yeah. like a bit of jail. Oh. Oh. He's close enough, though. He can make this. Yeah. Looks like there's a line. First five. Yeah, hey! <laughs> Good job, Alejandro. Way to do it. Kalen, it's hard to say whether he went OB or not. I'm assuming not. Oh, From where he's putting. Is that a yeah, three? Buddy. Oh, looks like a three. <laughs> he's smiling, so it must be a three. Unless they're just joking about something. Ooh, oh, that's ooh. a good stop. Got saved. Zone putt. Zone putt? That's all you have. I think that's all he's got left. Did, did they take his putters away from him? Awesome. I think they're just uh, fastball. I don't know. I'm not going to ask that. 
<laughs> so I think uh, Alejandro will be the, the sole person to lose the disc. Yes, to Caitlyn, who got that <laughs> solid <laughs> three. Oh, that teams? is a yeah. come on. If I'm not mistaken. Let's go. Oh, yeah? What even is it? Yeah. I don't know. What is the team's? What's that stand for on there? T E M I. T S A? Is it T E M I? Team? There's no I. There. <laughs> there is a V. Very astute. Oh, I think I have to. I think that was a, a Team TSA disc. How's your buzz button? Uh, the Votum. Oh. It throws out a lot. So. Skin more stable there. I personally love the backhand here. The forehand, ooh, especially shot. for that reason alone, it's a, it's such a pure backhand ace run mm -hmm. versus the forehand. You kind of got to get not lucky, but you got to miss, got to miss some trees to come in towards the basket. Was that Jake's going for the forehand? It's a great play. It's safe if you got a good forehand. Just put it down the path and let it skip in. Oh, miss it. Perfect. Yeah, oh, but yeah. yeah. Sit down. Oh, ooh, yeah. deep. Ooh, that's gonna be a tough comebacker. He's a really good putter. I put my money on him. Okay. Like chop this. Be sure some gambling now. <laughs> I wonder what uh, Adam got. Is this a Thunderbird? Maybe. Flies like a Thunderbird. Looks like a little little cut off, but it's better than going OB. He'll be wide open for a long putt. I feel like nowadays every player has a back in the forehand. You'd hope so if you want to be uh, truly competitive. Oh Ooh, no! Oh, cut Alejandro. and roll back. Roll back. Cut, roll back. Alejandro gets over on that forehand. Okay. Throwing three from here. You just gotta get. I don't even know. I think you have to try and throw it in maybe because so. potentially it's gonna be somebody. No long. That's okay. Long is better than short if you need to throw it in. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's in. Yeah. Oh. Everybody's gonna get their three. Yeah, worst uh, yeah worst case you're gonna get a three. So Alejandro needed that throw in, doesn't get it. Mm -hmm. yeah, Honestly, that putt was more for confidence than anything. So it's a solid bid. Yeah, it's a good good fun thing about this layout or not layout. This, um, this uh, format. This format is realistically, if you have a bad hole, you lose a disc, you move on, you have a better hole. That's not even worst case scenario. You have a bad hole, you lose three discs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's so, like worst case sorry. scenario. Sorry, now that you mention it, yeah, this is awful. Um, Jake seems bewildered by why that one didn't drop. Mm. Doesn't look like there's very much wind. He just gave it a little extra, maybe. Maybe he did rise. I believe this is for Kaylin's too, right? This would be either that. That backhand? Yep. Kaylin's mm -hmm. on fire right now. He's doing really well. After losing the first hit, yes. he's uh, kind of tearing it up right now. He turned it on. Uh, he should be, yeah. I yes, he should be. It's probably best that uh, yeah. Alejandro's probably hoping that Kalen made yeah, that disc. Like so he he shot putt, so you only had to lose one disc as opposed to three. True. Sometimes you're cheering for your friends. Sometimes you're cheering against them. I take the time. Maybe I gotta take some. What's he grabbing? Is that what it is? Oh, it was Adam Beatty who lost. I'll take this guy. The Pathfinder. Uh -huh. Alejandro's one of the just go to discs. It's gonna be a tough one of them to lose. Oh, this is a great hole. You see Alejandro trying to pawn off the mini, but he can't like this instead, right? Hey man, you gotta throw it out there. Never yeah. Know. Gotta play the game. Uh, hole 7, 415 feet. Uh, you could go over the water. A lot of people do have a power to make this. Mm -hmm. I think, I think, I think. The only problem is it's OB oh. yeah. short and then the road OB on the left. Yes, indeed. If you don't, that whole riverbed is OB. So if you don't get into short grass past, you're OB very early on. Mm -hmm. And we have one, it looked like Kalen was almost guaranteed OB. You'd almost rather Heiser early go OB over the path. And yeah. He's have to come back. Did, did Jake just throw that up to the bridge? Yeah. But that's Mine that's like four hundred fifty. Yeah, but he's still only moving up two hundred fifty. Oh, Adam! Smart oh, he's man. Like he's he's a, he just a saw two competitors man. going mm -hmm. to OB, so you know, good play, Adam. Oh, okay. That's true. Very good here. I wonder what. I looked a little inside, but luckily, I think that was his practice or maybe a spy. So two guys on the car get 
par, and the other two guys bogey. Do those two guys get the, oh, it's good. Get the two discs from the two guys that lost? It would be, yeah, so the two birdies would both take one disc from the two bogeys. Gotcha. Adam and uh, Adam and Alejandro kind of need to take the discs back now, so it's a tricky little upshot. Probably coming in about 220 feet. Oh, -hoo 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 -hoo. on the edge. Oh, mm -hmm. That oh, could be trouble. So juiced, and it's uh, long. Mm. I guess like if you're assuming that your car are getting threes. But I think you play for the four and you play for the best. Yeah, I mean, especially if someone else is uh, mm -hmm. playing for the four as well, right? All of a sudden, you're the only one losing this. Yeah. The intricacies of the game here. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. The man. Andrew, get a disc. Yes. On the board, as they say. Great putt. He must be trying. Oh. So that is. Adam to to guarantee an extra disc. If he misses this putt, then oh, that, yeah, you're all right. that would yeah. change is Alejandro now has the ability to take Adam. He makes it. But he does not care. He still makes it. I wonder if they oh. took his putt. I like, I think I, I didn't appreciate putters enough when I had something with this. Oh, shut up. I think he's putting with that. That's just his own. That's why I took yours out of life. Bro, I took yours. I don't really understand how hard it is to putt for this. He's like, literally, like, it's just high right here. Literally just stuck in the top right and fell. <laughs> Let's see it. Oh, taking one from Kalen. Smart call. He is the disc leader at this point. Do you think he's going back in for his pathfinder? He almost, he's going in with oh, he such, like, ferocity. He's he got to go back. for it. Yes, yeah, I did. knew it. He, is, he knows what he's after. That pathfinder is key for him. But we just showed him the card. What do you go for next when you have to pull from Alejandro? Yeah, it shows his this. Yeah, <laughs> you got to pretend like you don't care about it. I actually like the idea of bringing two of each disc. It's cool. it's a good idea until you're stuck with two of the same disc. True. True. Oh, it's the Pathfinder. It is the Pathfinder. It is fantastic. So throw like 300. Mm -hmm. Well, a uh, little uphill pot. Good. Taking it back and utilizing it right away. Thunderbird. I think he's been leaning on that thing for this. Whoa. Oh. He's in. Just on I the edge. And he had a little bit of a pop from down there. You want Thunderbird? It sounds like we don't have we don't know what color disc they're doing. Where are you thinking of? For my sheet? Yes. Yeah, she was missing color information, so we just have to take expert guesses from flight paths. This one's probably going to be Luna. No, his Luna was... Uh, you know, no, maybe it maybe is. Maybe it's a, a uh, It's going to be more stable no. than your green one. Because he has two destroyers. Could it be his zone or Thunderbird? <laughs> Who knows, actually. He's got a lot of discs. It could be somebody else's disc, too. This is the, the, the intricacies. Ooh, I thought he was going for the sign. The intricacy is of the roulette round is you never know what everyone's throwing after about seven holes. True. Adam, this would be a great putt from Adam if you can get this, too. Puts it off the cage. Putt. They're, all, they're all relatively tough putts. Like nobody's, nobody's really putting lights out today. So nothing is guaranteed at this moment. As the air balls out. Mm -hmm. Alejandro coming off a big putt on the last hole. As he can, can keep it chugging. Oh, 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 that's a good bid. That, that is a good amount of chains. Yeah, nothing wrong with that putt. So it looks like they're all taking a par. 
it sort of seems that way, unless, uh, unless Adam can surprise us here. Yeah. That zone is on point. Right now. <laughs> yeah, zone putter. This is his new putting style. Okay. You would expect at least one birdie coming from the whites up here, 245 feet uphill. Yeah, this is kind of like a, I would say, I don't want to say a guinea, but you, you're expecting to get the birdie here. Yeah. You're losing strokes to any sort of any sort of stroke play field mm -hmm. if you're taking threes. A three here feels like a bogey. Yeah, something like that. All right, the oh. Gander boys still going out of each other. Oh, Kale okay, got the two. Must have. Yeah. Yes. Well, you should pay more attention. No, no, it's, we're doing great. <laughs> we're now, so I think they are throwing from the new. The new tee pad that we got pushed back and right, where you just saw it come down from, was the old one. It had a nasty root in the middle of the tee pad. Mm. How many do you think that's on uh, rollers? Um, I don't know. If, does any of them even have a roller game? I've never seen any of them throw rollers. Do you think they're going pure air? I think they'll have the power to go pure air, that's for sure. That oh, this looks fantastic. Is a little bit too anti, but that's that's nothing wrong with that. Way down the hill. Mm -hmm. If you get that to pan, you could go for the three. Feel the basket. So you can go like once they all start running your rollers, then we don't stand a chance against our James. <laughs> what makes you think we have a chance to do that? <laughs> okay, is that a, Oh, yeah, it's in bounds. That's going to be a little pinched. It's another. Uh, yeah, it, 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 honestly, the second shot's more, more likely a layup, anyways. Mm -hmm. You'd have to really get a great drive out there if you want to go for the, the three on this one. This flexes out. This will be good. No, kept the aim even yep. the time. Still a great spot. Yep. You don't need to push too much on this one. You're not unless you're going for a really big distance. Maybe trying to get over in two. Yeah, it's the only time. The only reason you really need to really crush on it and hope for the best, because if you if you let it go and it hyzers out, you can go in that water. There it is. This looks. Like it's flexing. It yeah, down. a little high though, but it's still phenomenal. Oh, oh yeah, that's a great spot to he, be. Yeah, he's in the trees. Kind of cuts out his shot for the, uh, the over and two. Yeah, but it's a pretty simple approach then. Another hole where you really want to be. Ooh, oh, okay, yeah. He had. A, I guess he didn't have much to go with there. So another hole where you really want to be left on the uh, for the approach here. Mm -hmm. A couple trees block your way. Out of way too low. I say way too low. But he is left. He is left, and that is definitely where you want to be. That is perfect, in my opinion. Just a gentle skip. He'll be wide open to the basket. <laughs> Why not? Thank you, Dylan Michaud, for being our catch cam here. I think that is. Oh. Get safe. Oh, that Jake, is straight no. over here. Do you think he's going to go for it? I guess, but that was not the best for him. Oh, this is this is this is interesting. The Heiser play here. This is so dangerous because he hit any of those trees coming in, and yeah, you are straight over here. That look, be. <clears throat> exactly as we said. A little forehand here. I think Adam's got a confident mm -hmm. forehand, so if not borderline good. Flex. Come on, get up. Oh, oh, is that in? Oh, that's going to be so close. <laughs> what is Kaelin using here? Probably his own. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. That's the first one. Yeah, Jake went OB. Setting up for a side arm spike. Oh no, he was short again. He went OB. Oh, Jay. I gotta go again. <laughs> Guess he got a rethrow from there. Mm -hmm. As long as you don't lose that disc, because I think the I think the water is ice. So. Oh yeah. So there's not really much. Unless it floats away, but even then, I don't think it's gonna happen. There you go. That's a great shot. Yeah. Take two.
I would have to say that Ooh. this is one of uh, Chris Osmond's best designs. Yeah, this is this is. Uh, it's a fantastic horse, mm -hmm. and it keeps changing and keeps getting better. And oh, it's it's tough to make a golf course into a tree. Did not go to this. Yeah, because it's kind of repetitive. Yeah, there is some repetitiveness here too, but honestly, it's it, it's phenomenal. It's probably one of the best is golf course, disc golf courses I've ever seen. Really. Yeah, I agree. They do well with utilizing the property elevation, mm -hmm. and even including some of the trees. Oh, 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 He's putting on fire right now. Uh, mm -hmm. He's setting everything from this one. He's catching everything. Mm -hmm. I'll go. Oh, 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 oh. After a long hole like this, it's hard to keep track of it. I know that yeah, Jake's having some struggles, so I think he's going to run the disc, but he's going to get it. No. Tap them all out. Did he? Was he in bounds on his uh, Oh, that's a good point. I'm I, 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 I don't remember him throwing it in. How many people do you think are going to walk in with the long Um, I've only known of two people crazy enough to try it. Um, one is sitting next to me, and the other one at that point was very wet. Uh, a force. I guess it's it was that, that, that took it. Yeah, Kaylin comes oh, in. Hold on. Oh, they both get one. Oh, oh Alejandro loses one to. Uh, what did he just take there? That looks like his fireball back. The photon? Fi uh, no, I think that was Adam's fireball oh, that uh, Alejandro took earlier. Gotcha. It's always whites, it's always mediums. So that... There's a very tricky no. pass. Yeah, there's there's a couple of different ways you can come at this. Like I like I, I do like this play, but I find if you get too much of it, you're going in the water hole. Yeah. As he oh. tries to ace it. You can also take it wide and skip it in. Probably the safer of all the options. It is the safer option, but it is hard. You, the gap is a lot tinier. Oh I forgot I didn't really think about it beforehand. I never really think about it beforehand. Mm, I I thought about it, but I think there's a lot of things in the way. Mm -hmm. But again, it, it, it mitigates the ability of going long into the water. So Right. Coming in on that angle. Yeah. I still think the backhand hyzer, just to the right of that tree uh, that I'm not... The pine tree? Yeah. The tree that I'm not about to... Here we go. ...attempt. This is the gap you want to hit. You just It just got over on him. But he's still out in the open. Is that Pathfinder? I think so. That's a long throw for a Pathfinder. I don't know it says 227, but... Feels longer. Yeah, I don't know if those numbers are right. Oh my god. Ooh. Got a little bit of a tickle off the tree. Yeah. He keep, got over. Wow, he kept him short, but still he made it through the tree that he hit and pushed it back in bounds. So. That's a long putt. Mm -hmm. Good to get it close. Guarantee your three. This just don't seem to be staying in the air for a lot of our competitors here. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh as I say that, Adam oh. drains a lot. <laughs> Is that like his zone? I think so. Zone, wow. master zone putter. There must be like crazy headwind out there. It must be as I'm like dead still. <laughs> I've always said once you get inside, once you get inside about 20, 25 feet, they all fly the they same. They all fly the same. Kalen's on a, just a tear right now. Ten discs. Eleven now. Yeah, I guess so. Who's he going to get one from? Whomever he wishes? I suppose so. Is that how like it goes, or is it dependent oh. on, like, Oh, sorry. Off? That's right. You know what? As long as the discs are staying inside Gander. <laughs> <laughs> I think Jake just lost his wraith. Or his horse. Alejandro. What is that? Is that his putter? I think that's uh. That's his spy? Yeah, that was his spy. Hmm. 
There you go. A lot of discs moving hands in this round. That's what we want to see. Get us some excitement coming up here. Although Caitlyn seems to have the majority of the. He seems to be throwing a Kaldenheim destroyer. Make it. That's a great take flex. My legs up. He needs to get up the hill. Oh, he oh. does. That's beauty. Name it for our camera operator. He's nice got a shot. nice 30 foot pot into the basket. See, this is where you take your opponent's disc and just chuck it. <laughs> just, oh. well, let me see, let me see your putter you got there. I think I, I, think I can make it I with a putter. I, you know, I've always wanted to throw. A <laughs> just it. Mm -hmm. it says 359, but that's just to uh, just that, to be. Well, I think that that is to the basket, but it's also about five to ten feet uphill. Yeah, probably. Oh, that's a great throw. Yeah, Alejandro can make it, but there's no point in risking it if. Uh, if you don't need to. Right. What do you think Jake's doing here? It's hard to say. Jake's been kind of picked clean for discs, so. Ooh, this looks good. That was throwing hard. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, he, he's inbounds, oh, wow. luckily. Oh. This one, the bank does not. Oh, really? But no, that is inbounds. The bank does not play as OB on this hole. Great shot. Alejandro was sure. laying it up perfectly, playing the hole to perfection. I almost felt like I heard their voices. I hear voices all the time. Kalen for the two. Oh. This is a tough putt up this hill. Mm -hmm. Comes in like you can't get any leg power. Yeah, yep. and that's traditionally what happens. You kind of have to overdo it, and then you know, you know how it goes. It's oh yeah, a, it's you, a gotta, tough one. You, you gotta compensate something, mm -hmm. right? You almost want to throw over the basket. Yeah, aim high, and, and but then the one time you hit it perfectly. Yeah. <laughs> all in all, I think it pretty three that right. Caleb with the best opportunity. I would say so. Yeah. I'm a little surprised that the bank is playing in balance. Oh uh, yeah, I think the bank only plays OB on the river holes. Oh, okay. So all the water holes, the uh, it's actually a the bank grave. is safe. Mm, gotcha. It seems a little, that'd be really punitive if, uh, if they made that OB. It's not exactly given a, a premium spot by landing on that bank. That's true. Hole 12, I like hole 12. It's a really good te technical you know, gap hit shot, even though it doesn't look that way, but those trees are hard to get by. How do you play it? Uh, I usually go with like some sort of immediate neutral fairway right up the middle. Okay. I personally like to throw a hyzer over the three pine trees on the right. Yeah, I find uh, I don't mind that one, but I find if you really get a hold of it, you catch those trees in the deep right. And if you're in those trees in the deep right, you may not get out. That's true. Oh my word. As Kalen seems to really want to go test that theory. That was that went in pretty clean. No, it's, it's on the edge-ish. Ish. Adam seems like the guy who would go high. Mm -hmm. So, let's see how he can do it. There it is. That's the one you're talking about. And oh, there oh, it is. Oh, it's yeah. dragged oh, into the trees. I think he's on the outside, though. So that's not too bad. Oh, it's kind of a shot. <laughs> Alejandro, I think, is a guy who will want want to want to hit that gap up the middle. Mm-hmm. Like Pathfinder. Oh, he yanked it though. Yeah. Maybe I don't know if he was limited to a Pathfinder, but I think something a little faster may have been uh, been prudent in that situation. Mm -hmm. I think Jake's going to fire. Really. That would make sense. Is he going? To, is he going Heiser though? I think he's trying to go up the middle. Yeah, that's that's a great play there. Oh, <laughs> those trees claimed yeah. everybody. Yeah, nobody, nobody really got good luck there. Not even close. Oh, great approach. You're no kidding. Tap in those trees. If you don't put it in the perfect spot, you could be 15 feet from the basket and have zero. Cut. I feel like a three might win you the hole as well. Right. Yeah. <laughs> everybody else is kind of in the deep stuff. Yeah, you don't need to push too much there. Adam lucky to get out of the trees, but obviously making a good shot to do it. 
Oh, oh they, no. I think Kalen's oh, being a little bit... Uh, aggressive? A little bit aggressive with his uh, six-disc six lead. Trying to th skip it in. It'd be pretty sweet if he makes the comeback, too. Yeah, it's true. Give it a shot. That's true. That would be pretty cool, but it would also be cool if everyone threed it and he took a four and lost <laughs> three discs and made this made this Ooh. match again. Ooh, I didn't yeah. even think of that. <laughs> So I think everyone's parked for the three. So if Kalen misses, they all get their choice. And they're not taking your worst discs. They're taking your best discs. Mm -hmm. Just have a feeling he's going to make it, though. Oh, he's short. Oh, no. Why do I have to tap that in? Do I? Is he even going to bother putting it? I don't think so. That makes this interesting. I kind of forgot that I lose three when I. I get you back into the game. I kind of forgot I was looking at something earlier too. I would say yes. At least my ankles are cold. Just let's go. Oh, I'm half handed enough to make this. Oh, yeah, the chains out. He has a great putt from there. He knows it doesn't matter. He's still finishing it up. Get yourself a little confidence boosting putt there, right? He's so pumped. Uh, Adam. Love the energy oh. of these guys. Guys, please. Please help yourself. Mm -hmm. Buffet time. Oh, you can miss. Oh, don't take my votum. I want that. Oh, who do you think it is? Dang it, I like that one. I just don't. Do I don't think, think I should take that. his go right now. Probably take two. Discs? Smart. Yo, he took his best. He <laughs> takes it back. Mm -hmm. nice. Stable. I think Adam may have taken his part of that. Yeah, back. Dang it, why'd you? All right. I want that. So how many do you have right now? Right there. Uh, I have. Brings Kalen back to just a two-stroke lead. I don't know if uh, Adam took his putter, his Luna. You know, I had Paul McBeth on it. I don't think Adam has any. It's, it's true. I think that thing is it's true. Wow, we got to sell the game. I think Adam actually has one of my bags. That's okay. It'll get rectified soon enough. That is the the zone again on the forehand. That is an ace run, man. It's oh, it's <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Pretty good at the shot, but that oh, too fast. Oh, yeah. oh. that's still it's pretty so good though. It stayed up. To stop on this <laughs> First, you hit the the fart back. Oh, right. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. It catches the it catches the path. Maybe lucky. Yeah, got Have your putting putter back. Yeah. yeah. Maybe yeah, it makes sense. It's a long putt for a very scary putt down the hill. Mm -hmm. Gotta do is make sure you catch him mad. Oh, oh no. Kalen is giving it all back. Oh, great. That was a great putt. Go straight to him and he did it. There's a rivalry Solid there for day. sure. Hang it just now. Straight up from that. Oh! My Hunter actually has a, a window at it. <laughs> this looks so tough. Look at his left leg is almost up above his hip. Nice. He still makes the putt. That's a uh, two discs. Unless he makes this. Oh, no. <laughs> That is a great save. Uh, I don't think Let's go! No. I like that hitting throw a lot. Yeah, save the legs. I don't know if you're kidding or not. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, it flies like yeah, a PA3 except I don't like the feel of it. Got, uh, got aggressive. Sadness. Sadness Everdeen. Alejandro thinking right now. Zone. Please take the 4 clock. Honestly. Can you take the four clock? <laughs> it's just that, so jaked up. Looks like they're already on the like, whole. They don't have that it's one hole in between this. They did not play a hole. Oh, they didn't. Yeah. Oh, it's just a T bird basically. Straight 19 hole layout here. Uh, oh, yeah. take the mid. Take the mid. Please. Oh, it's a shame. I like Dang it. It's crushed. Here's your four clock, buddy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Kalen knew. Kalen yeah. knows right away. Yeah, I'm down to Jake five. Coming for that buzz. So are they all squared up now? Or is Kalen down? I still think Adam has a bit of a deficit. I could be wrong though. Mm. Oh, looks like everybody is everybody at six now? That doesn't make sense. I think there might be something wrong with their ticker. 
Unless that's accurate. Possible. I haven't been following with the, exactly who's lost what. This, if you get too deep in the right oh. again, it's another. You just don't want to be right. Oh, exactly. Forehand, eh? I don't. I don't know if I like this play coming coming in at the basket on the forehand. It's just gonna skip slope? down the hill into that tree into that tree line. We said you don't want to be in. That's if you're uh, if you get clean. Yeah. One time. Oh. No, okay. Like, yeah, th even <laughs> if that was clean, it still would have skipped into the bush. Yeah, I just, I don't, like, with the hillside, that, ooh, ooh. that is early. Yeah, he knew right out of the This challenge gets oh. someone <laughs> oh. this Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. That, I got some point. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't like he this He got off to such a great lead, <laughs> and now he's just sort of... I want to run this so bad. He's still in it, obviously. Yeah. Like, he's still tied with everybody yeah, else. I wonder if he's just, like, yeah. reliving... I wouldn't mind losing a stroke. kind of went for it. I don't know if you realize what could have happened. At that point, you have to understand that. He, you, have, you have to assume he didn't understand, right? Right, because he would have laid up if he realized he was going to lose three gifts. Yeah, I keep I keep thinking, or forgetting myself, and I've done this many times, so it's easy to, to get caught up in the moment. Mm -hmm. Alejandro with a good bid from really far away. You guys can watch this. Yeah, probably uh, do that. Backhand. It looks rough in there. At this point, nobody's getting the two, I don't think, so unless it's a big putt, so just get up and get your three, save your discs, if you can, obviously. Typically, when you get into a situation like that, do you just look for some sort of line that has a chance, and then if there isn't that line, you're just like, all right, I'm late. I think the biggest goal there is just get within 20 feet. It's pretty Come confident, most of you guys are pretty confident, 20-footers. 20, 20 oh, so. mm -hmm. oh, boy. Doesn't, don't need to be parked, just need to make the putt. Adam like got through got, all of this. He uh, got lucky. He kicked up, rolled. Really? Like, oh, tried. that's unfortunate. This this could be bad for Adam. Mm -hmm. yeah. That guy did not look easy. No. Oh, no. He might be the sole bogey. Three more discs coming out of his bag. Yeah. We might get the correction right here. <laughs> He's been with my like 60 <laughs> Oh no. That's three more going for that. This game is oh, annoying me, and I'm wow. not even one. Wow. Yeah, the roulette rounds can <laughs> swing quick. Action. Oh, he has six discs. He does, yes. That's five. that five. He has five back. He got his Luna. Oh, he took his Luna. <laughs> he did. <laughs> <laughs> He's upset by that. I don't even want a disc anymore. Oh, that was a, that was a dirty move. It was. Take that, Caleb. <laughs> Nine speed is. Oh, no. I love it. That's strategy right <laughs> I love there, it. Man. I love it so much. Well played. What is Adam left with, though? I think Adam might be left with only drivers. I think so. You can't get a cover. Excal. Throw up your hand. Not quite enough. That's going to be a long putt. It's tough to get over that hill and have it slow enough that it doesn't blow by it. You could throw a straight shot. Heiser, mm -hmm. Sider. You see that he threw the Luna. Oh, he threw, yeah, yeah he, he did. He threw Kalen's Luna. You used to throw Lunas? Like, why am I throwing this Luna on this all? Yeah. I have not gone Luna. I guess it's here. the harp. It only started a week ago. Uh, I've played harp. here an insane amount of time. Yeah, yeah, in that I'm not just a kid. He's a tomato. Oh! Better than the Luna, anyways. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think he's getting an outside circle. He's got a pretty special putt at it. I think he has the cleanest putt so far out of everybody. Flex, flex for it. Ooh. Okay. Not flex forehand with a fireball. That is a uh, Heiser. Yeah. <laughs> and a bank Heiser. Getting Roach? I don't know if anybody going to do that. I guess Kalen. Kalen had the great drive. I think that was helpful. Up and down, that's right. I 
just don't see the benefit of running this when you know somebody. Well, okay, oh, oh, as he does it. Eye. And a tail yeah. so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can give that a healthy run. Kaylin can make this. He'll get, regain his lead. Oh, Great. Oh, uh, that's a huge spot. What do you think he's taking? I think he's going to get his lead back. I, I think if I was slighted in that way, I would go after one of Jake's six. The buzz? The buzz, yeah. So, something that something oh, that Jake I think, likes. I think he just took it. See that? He's oh. just like, I'm taking my, uh, <laughs> my Luna back. Uh, mind games. I think Jake yep. He's already pulling it out. <laughs> I, I definitely. Oh, Alejandro got his... His, uh, <laughs> happens to all of us. He got his, his glove caught on the nub. Sometimes I feel like these baskets are better for catching gloves than they are <laughs> for discs. Uh, Alejandro. Hold together technically in the lead right now until uh, until Kaylin gets his disc back. <laughs> <laughs> not even a not even a second thought. Nice. I still want to go after the buzz, just just for Jake, just cause just cause Jake slighted you. You know what though? He might use this. He might use his Luna for the shot. That might be why he grabbed it. It is wait, it's from the whites though, right? Mm -hmm. Two hundred thirty-one feet now. I have a feeling he has one. Yeah, he does. does. It is the right shot. I feel like the the side arm. It's, it's so good, but if you if you. Oh, it's good. Oh, if, if you like roll your wrist or turn it over a little too much, you're OB so early. True. But it is. I think it is the better shot, and you have to kind of keep it low too. Uh oh, like this fl could hit. Fl the... Flirt with those signs. Oh, he... oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Puts it just inside. I can't believe that. Yeah. I thought you were gonna it's, climb. It's a tough shot with those signs there, because getting below the trees and above the signs is tough. But then again. Coming in, coming in on the highs of this way is also really, really tough. Oh, thanks. You didn't, didn't make that look tough at all. No, Alejandro just made me eat my words. Mm. How'd they taste? Um, salty. Oh, yeah? No cherries? No cherries this time. Another fireball forehand. Didn't go well last time we threw it. Oh. Okay. Nice shot. I mean, I'm assuming. Yeah, everyone's sort of in the exact same spot. Within, all within eight feet of each other. They're not just a putt off. This kid wants to just do a straddle. Great putt. Uh, with that, I'm expecting a star birdie right now. I don't know. You don't know? They've got these four players all putting within 20 feet. Yeah, but the wind's howling. Just absolutely raging. Couldn't have asked for, uh, for, uh, for worth, for, for worth wins. That flag, you can almost tell what number it says. Oh, it's being weighted down. It's like a metal flag. Oh, oh he's putting with a Thunderbird. See, I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> Great catch on the Thunderbird. Oh, hey. maybe a little oh, nervous there, not wanting to lose three discs. All right. <laughs> All of a sudden, the closest uh, yep. shot is like feels the furthest. Yeah. Three holes to go. Quite a tight match here. Things don't. Can't even really. Can't even really count, count Adam out if he just wins these last three holes. Furthest or farthest? It, depending on the context. Yeah, how about that context? It felt like the furthest. It's definitely farthest. <laughs> it's not furthest. You're right? wrong. <laughs> I'm not going to get into a grammar conversation with you right now, but not furthest, all of you people out there. <laughs> no way. I was going for the wide okay Heiser spike. Yeah, I, that came up a little high, I think, and he absolutely That's parked. Crazy. That was incredible. Uh, I think he's a little bit like maybe circle from this angle. Yeah, maybe you're right. It's so tough to go around that tree and get it to it's the back. It's just so far. Oh, that's really good. I mean, this looks parked. No. And, okay, he's leaning up against that tree. He's got it's that. Inside circle. Yeah, that's that. Wow. 20 feet? He's got a really good disc golf. Are you going to go buzz? Mm. Yeah. You crazy boy. Is a photon, I think? It looks like some sort of MVP. Whoa, this is going the distance. 
the distance the wrong way. Yeah. Yeah. Great shot for the golf hole. Mm -hmm. well, looks a little inside. Oh. Yeah, he's gonna come up. Though. He's gonna come up a bit short. But he's got a chance. Putt. Yeah, it is. It is slightly downhill too on the putt. So you run it, you may not stop. True. There's a good amount of strategy in this format. <laughs> I like it. Ooh, he leaves that quite early. Yeah. See, would you lay this up? Or would you run it? Um, Knowing for, that, like, for Adam, Alejandro has a tough putt to make. Adam needs to win holes. Oh. So Adam should run it. Gotcha. You make a good point. That being said, Alejandro needs to make this to not lose three... Three discs, probably three maybe discs. two. Oh, Ooh. as he changes that, now he's hoping that only one of okay. the next two people make their putt. Mm -hmm. So he only loses the one disc. Oh, there's the one. Let's so see if Jake. So now he's probably hoping Adam is going to miss his putt, so he's not losing three. That's true. He's losing one. Well, Adam's already putting for three. Yes. Oh, oh okay. no. All right, three discs gone. No, because I. Because uh, uh, Kalen got the two. True. And, and Adam guy's going to get a three at best. So okay. maybe if Jake makes this, he loses two discs. Right, right, right. Which, with two holes to go, is... <gasps> oh, no. Oh, goodness. Oh, Jake. Alejandro's dreams are coming true. Oh, oh no. no. What's happening now? It's the raging wind. <laughs> the phantom wind. <laughs> Not the fact that he's putter with a thunderbird. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I, I completely lost track of what just happened. Um, so Alejandro's gonna take uh, four? Yes, or one, five. Two, three, four, five, yeah. And he's only using one disc. That's actually yep. the best case scenario yep. for Alejandro. <laughs> he's like prop the Pathfinder up there. Why? It's that smirky you gotta, little. You gotta hide oh, it, man. I, I, th I think Alejandro knows he's not throwing the Pathfinder on the next two holes. Oh, that's why he's like, hey, that's my favorite disc. Good strategy. Kid's smarter than all of us, I guarantee you that. I mean, it's not a hard, high bar for that. I know, I know. But... <laughs> One would like to dream. Just wait until we blow the beer. We got nothing. <laughs> oh, this looks fantastic. Well, that does look fantastic. You do want to kind of push it oh, long. Okay. That was um, a destroyer. That's a little much. You don't want to push it that long. I usually go something particularly overstable or far here because yeah, you, it's farther than it looks. I feel like a firebird is a good. It can be bird. if you have good footing, but it's just it's so much farther than it looks, and you do want to kind of skip it from right to left. So firebird would work if you threw it flat. Mm -hmm. That was the buzz, I think. That was his buzz. And he left it forty short. The four times. The four times. Not six times down. Mm. Scratch two more claws in there. That oh, oh, still, still deep. That that one's that yeah, one's on the edge. He'll have a straddle. Mm -hmm. But that tree might be right in his way. All right, what's Alejandro got to throw for us? It looks green. Yeah, yellow green. I think that's the votum. No, I, what was that disc? It could have been. It could have been the votum, I guess. Oh, he's in a he's in a tough spot, but mm -hmm. <clears throat> as long as nobody else is. Uh, I don't think he's the target right now because he's got well, he's got six discs, so maybe. It's Jake. It was 35, 40 footer. Oh no. Into the bushes. Kalen. <laughs> he's deep in the brush. Yep, you gotta. This doesn't look like an easy putt either. Those branches are just hanging down over his face. Oh, this is for his three, too. This is. This is trouble. What a putt. Hey, so that keeps that him in it. That's for sure. Yep. Yeah. He's in risk there. 
I don't know if he can catch Kalen with only... I don't, he can't catch Kalen with only one hole to go. Well, realistically, but... To keep himself ahead of Alejandro for that second place. Mm -hmm. Nice. 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 Oh, he got the two. He did. Yeah. He put his back. And I think he gets his pick of the... Uh, his pick, of, his pick of whatever he wants. Don't let Jake win this. So what's your strategy if you had that pick right now? Do you go, do you go for one of Alejandro or Jake to try to sneak into second, or do you go against Kalen and hope to pull him down? Take someone that he's gonna throw. But I need to putt with the half like 18 driver here. Get back into the game. Just take the path. So, yeah, you gotta take someone that he's gonna throw in the hole. I can throw any one of these distances. I don't think. I think he has too many distance drivers to. Uh, Take the zone. To actually his zone. zone. Yeah. It, oh, and especially sick. since Adam doesn't have a putter. This guy's crazy. Zone. Yeah. This is throwing. Yeah. He's throwing. Mm -hmm. But I think he took a fast wire. This is a fun hole. This is OB left with the path. Uh, OB bunkers or hazard bunkers and OB green up there protects the basket. It's the approach shot, I would say, the trickiest part of this hole. It's true. You can get a nice, safe drive out there and, and then you have to work on it, but it, the uh, coming in with that bunker right where you want to land your disc to skip it up to the basket. When you can go over the hill, you skip down outside circle. Mm -hmm. Or if you're very short on the right side, you're on the green. Uh, yep, that, that, that's a problem too. Let's see what Adam can do here. I don't think he has one of his so discs, awesome. so he's hoping that this thing is overstable. Here. Yeah, that thing is going for the bushes. Hit the brakes. Oh, he did. I don't know if he's gonna have much out there with all those outstretched branches, but all right, am I good? we could only hope. Mm -hmm. Oh, leaned in hard on this. But he always throws overstable discs. I wouldn't be surprised if that comes out and it doesn't. Oh. Not. Yeah, uh, yeah that's just good. in time. Is that a Calvin Calvin Destroyer? That is Halo. Oh yes. Yes. Jake is leaning in on his uh, horse. That looks pretty fantastic. Dead center fairway. Very conservative. Doesn't go for too much, but still gets a great drive out there. Mm -hmm. Well, Hunter, the blue disc, I don't recognize. Oh, this is the photon again. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Turn, 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 turn. Oh. No. So what is that? Re-T, eh? Re -t, never came, never came in bounds. Oh, oh no! No, stay okay. in bounds. Stay in bounds. No. Did it? I don't know. This did it? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> the oh, suspense. Yeah, killing me. <laughs> Alejandro throwing four from here. Oh no. No, it's coming back. Okay, yeah. Keeping it away from the OB, I guess. Alejandro oh. just pushing this up here, trying to just Great shot. come in third, I guess. Not lose three discs. Had him from the bush. This looks tough. Yeah. I'm surprised he's going, trying to go with the forehand. I guess there's just no room to do a backhand or a patent pending. Yeah, I'm assuming his reach is cut off, so any little wrist flick he can get out. Oh, it's actually decent, too. Oh, that, that's great. Is that going for bunker? Nope. That's perfect. That's a great shot. Yeah. From in that bush. Mm -hmm. Jake's, Jake's kind of got to put park this to give him a chance of taking a disc, but he's, no matter what, I think he's taking it from Alejandro, so. Yeah. <clears throat> I think he needed everybody to be decent. Mm hmm. Kalen can, Kalen can jump putt his way to victory right now. As he, ooh, that's a good shot. Is that Kalen or Jake? I thought that was. I thought Jake threw the last shot. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, here's Kalen. Okay. Was that just a redo? I'm not like, sure what that was. It was really unusual. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh, oh no! Wow. <laughs> I have never seen that I'm happen before. That's, like a scumbag. <laughs> That's exciting. Look at the smile yeah, on his face. He knows. He knows. All part of the plan. <laughs> I 
Alejandro with a big putt to finish it off and just misses it. Nice putt. There you go. Finish for Kalen to really, really went up to 12, went back down to 6, went back up to 9 or 8, whatever he's going to take. He got to play a little recklessly and yeah. he still cashed out. Don't you hate when you don't get their uh, <laughs> just rewards? Their just rewards? Their just desserts, per se. Uh, with cherries on top? <laughs> Definitely with cherries. Good job, Alejandro. Good work. Definitely, uh, definitely played well today. Actually, they all played. They all played pretty well. Putting was a little suspect around, but they're all in all they're all really good players and all really really things. So this is who is going on to the next round. The two G Gander boys. Well done, guys. Yes, Caleb with nine, Jake with six, Alejandro coming with five, and Adam with four. Yeah, it was a well fought battle. Yes, indeed, it was a great game. Um, uh, I am Chris Brown. And I'm James Duell. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time. See you guys. He just sits upstairs. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He'll be down. He just sets a timer for the length of the video. Oh, okay. And he can hear us talking about him. So patiently waiting. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as I heard James say that, I was like, they are done. Yeah.